What's going on YouTube? It's Mike here. Today guys in this video I'm going to be talking about iOS 8 Beta 3. Now before we start this video guys I would just like to apologize for the lack of videos over the last week, almost two weeks. Uh, right after I got back from VidCon I caught a really bad virus and I've been sick for the last two weeks so uh, almost two weeks as a matter of fact, so I apologize for not uploading any videos and uploading this video a day late as well. I'm just about finished recovering, so trust me, it was worth it. But anyways, uh, yesterday, Apple went ahead and released the third beta version of iOS 8, and I'm running it right now on my iPhone 5S. I'll prove it to you. It's general and about, and you can see right there, my 8.0 software is a different build from all the others. I don't really think it's a big deal if I prove it to you or not. Um, but so beta 3 actually provides a slew of new features and one of them is actually the fact that you can now enable handoff um, on your iDevices to work with uh, Yosemite on your Mac. So if you don't have Yosemite, obviously that's not going to work yet. Uh, if you do have Yosemite, uh, that is pretty cool too. But it'll work also with other Apple devices. So for example, I could work it uh, with my iPad. So basically I could just pick up from where I left off um, in all of my applications. It's actually really cool. Um, also, uh, there you go, I go to software update, you can see I'm at the most recent version, and there's a ton of other cool features here and there, a lot of bug improvements and fixes, which I was really happy about. Uh, overall, iOS 8 was stable, very stable to begin with, um, especially over iOS 7, because it, you know, iOS 8 wasn't that big of an upgrade, so, I mean, there's not much to fix, uh, some other, uh, big things in Beta 3, uh, we got iCloud Drive, which now works, so... As you can see right there, iCloud Drive, there it is right there. Um, so the only app that's actually been enabled so far that I have on my phone uh, for iCloud Drive is TweetBot, and I think the devs over at TweetBot um, are already updating their app for iOS 8, and so that's why it's available. But right now, I don't think you should have any apps available. If you do, it uh, might mean some app developers are looking into the iOS 8 iCloud Drive development, so if you do, that's pretty cool. Uh, if you don't, you're just going to have to wait till the final release when all the apps are ready. But basically, you just keep all the information uh, from all of your apps in one place so when you move to different devices uh, it's not very different if you know what I mean so uh, other than that you know I heard there's a couple new wallpapers and stuff not too much um, but anyway so if you want to go download this I will leave links in the description below uh, so you can actually go get the latest beta firmware uh, you do need to have your UDID registered and you can do that by going to UDIDregistrations.com I'll also leave a link in the description there I believe their prices are five dollars per device right now so uh, you should definitely go check them out. Uh, go get your iDevice registered so you could be running iOS 8 before everyone else. It's uh, pretty worth it. iOS 8 brings a lot of cool features. Um, so yeah, and then also if you're already running iOS 8, then you don't need to download it from the description. You just go settings, general, software update, um, and you update right there. But if you're on iOS 7, and let's say for example, uh, you want to upgrade to iOS 8 first, you'll have to go in the description and you'll have to register with UDIDregistrations.com and then you can go download the firmware with the link I provided. So yeah, so guys, that's pretty much it. If you like this video, please leave some comments below on your thoughts. Of course, rate give this video a thumbs up and click the subscribe button below and stay tuned guys I'll have some more videos coming this week I'm continuing to get more better and well uh, so I'm going to work as hard as I can I really want to get back into videos um, I just really haven't felt the best the last couple of days um, but I'm feeling better so I'm coming back alright guys so thank you for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one